I'm Warren Davis, and you're watching The Evercade Effect. Evercade Effect. Hey, everybody. Oh, my God. I am so excited. This is the official announcement of the Tomb Raider collection. I have not yet watched the trailer or know very, very little about it. I know the release is going around. I didn't want to address this out of respect for Blaze until the official announcement. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and roll the trailer. I did mute the sound because last time when I did that, it was copyrighted and it was kind of weird. So, oh my God, let's take a look. All right, Peggy 16, coming to Evercade. Tomb Raider Collection 1. Ooh, ooh. <gasps> This is so nostalgic. Oh my god, I haven't seen Tomb Raider 1 in years since the demo disc on a PS1. Wow! And Tomb Raider 2, I've never even played Tomb Raider 2! Oh my god. And then Tomb Raider 3. This, this, this wow. Now we know what the Giga Disc is, <laughs> the Giga Card is for, for games like this to all fit on one card. This is an oh my god! Incompatible and Super Pocket! Woohoo! Available in July. Yep, and so that's what's going to be bundled with the with the VSR and EXPR. And I, you know, I, I kind of I kind of went ahead and uh, and suspected that. Wow, this is great news! Oh my god! So yeah, first we got the Giga Card announcement, talking about multiple you know be able to fit multiple uh, CD games on one disc, right? So they teased that. Then we got the EXPR. And uh, the VSR announcement, and they were saying it was going to come with one of the bundled games, one of the Giga Card bundled games. And now we know that that is Tomb Raider. Woo! This is excellent news, everyone. This this is something special, right? I mean, yes, it's not a Capcom cart, it's not a Namco, it's not a Sega, but you know what? <sighs> Tomb Raider is a big IP. This is a huge win for Blaze, and we know that's also going to be the packing cart. So the more expensive cart is going to come with the VS, and it's going to come with the EXP. So really, it's like, yes, it's it's a, it's $100 USD, but really it's it's $75 USD uh, because the car comes with it, which that is an incredible deal. That almost makes me maybe possibly want a second VS. I don't know. We'll have to see. Um, but wow, this is, oh, this is awesome. I hope everyone is excited, as I am excited. As I mentioned, the trailer is playing. I can remember when my buddy first got a PS1, and uh, yeah, I remember I remember playing Tomb Raider, playing as Laura Croft uh, uh, on that on that demo disc. It also had Ridge Racer, and I, and I forget whatever else, and just replaying like that first level over and over again. Because when I when he bought it, I don't think he really had any other games or not that many games, uh, maybe like Tekken or something. But that that's how impactful Tomb Raider is. I remembered that. I remember playing the the demo and all that. And I know before some naysayers get out there, well, there's no analog controls. Yes, well the original. Like Tomb Raider games had tank controls. They didn't have analog controls. Would it play better with analog? Yes, but the game was designed as is to play with tank controls. And I'm sure, like in uh, you know, in pure Blaze fashion, they've gone ahead and they've modified uh, the game to even play a little bit better with the Evercade controllers. Let me know in the comment section below. Are you super excited like this? Are you picking up this collection? Are you excited this is bundled with the EXP and VSRs? You know, let me know this. Wow, this just this just really made my day. I am I am super happy. And again, I can't stress this enough. This is a big IP and uh, and a beloved IP uh, to get on the Evercade. Yes, it's not a Sega or a Capcom or, or Konami or whatever, but this is exciting news. I'll go ahead and leave it there. Thanks everyone so much for watching and bye bye. Thank you, Crashline, Mr. Shua, and the Immortal Soldier!